Fabricate storylines, create dark clouds. I heard tonight that fabricated stories bring dark clouds, and I want to address some fabricated stories. One of, one, one of them is that the camp that was bulldozed two weeks ago was transient. It didn't have people living there. That is not true. That was said by a police officer here two weeks ago. I had interviewed five people who had lived in that camp for at least four months. They all say that they all have the same story. They are not communicating with each other or coming up with fake stories. They are credible people who are living in that camp. The police officers, in fact, knew their names, called them by their names, and Miss Pamela, they Miss Pamela, back in the day. This is true. Okay, so what was said two weeks ago, a fabricated story. Great. Another fabricated story that was said on the radio two weeks ago, the day after the city hall, last city council meeting. Advocates are keeping people homeless for the money, said by the mayor until the NRI. This is also obviously not true. If you have any kind of idea of how these things work, you can say, oh, you can come up with conspiracy theories about that. But the truth is, advocates are working to help homeless people to end homelessness. So we want to talk about fabricated stories bringing dark clouds. There's another state, um, phrase that I really like as a journalist, which is, democracy dies in darkness. And I think that's why I talk. I, I don't usually speak at public meetings, but I felt it's important to say what I said to you. So I thank you for your time. Thank you. Thank you.